everybody. Thank you for coming down here. My name is Dan, and I think the Federal Reserve sucks. That's why I registered FederalReserveSucks.com many years ago. So, everybody, let's have a little chance, because every time I ask the cops, the government, the Bureau of Criminal Apprehension, the intelligent people down at the Capitol, how the drug money gets through the banks, nobody denies it. Nobody says, oh no, there isn't any drug money at the Federal Reserve. Nobody's willing to make that statement. So, right at, repeat after me, when I say, where's the, you say, drug money. <laughs> Ready? Where's the? Drug money. Where's the? Drug money. Where's the? Drug money. Where's the? Drug money. They are terrified of that. Let me just say, I've been involved in Occupy Wall Street since the day it started. Everybody in Occupy knows that the Federal Reserve is bullshit. Everybody knows it. I'm telling you, and the Fed signs are everywhere. They are afraid of information. These people are terrified of information. The Occupy Minnesota came down here on Monday, and they protested here, they chalked this thing, said the Central Bank robbed you, which is true, and they erased that chalk within two hours at two in the morning, because they're terrified of information. So here's how you end the Fed. You gotta hack the Fed, not illegally. You have to map out all the computer systems. You have to map out exactly how the credit is created in the computer system. You have to map out how the money is transferred in and out of the system. You have to design an alternative to the Federal Reserve called the Open Fed. A temporary. So you can create a replacement to the Federal Reserve that is not a ripoff. You have to demand the state government in Minnesota state government makes zero percent bonds for public financing with a replacement Federal Reserve. You have to analyze the structure of the state bank in North Dakota because we do not need to pay middlemen interest for public projects. We do not need to do that. It is a rip-off. You can tax the Fed. No, listen, you just have to find out all the computer systems, map out exactly how it works, and then you just have to stay listed. This is a private organization that pays property taxes and launders drug money. It is a public nuisance. You can use eminent domain to seize this building because it annoys the public in Minnesota, it annoys the public, and it corrodes our morals because they launder drug money. And we can seize this building, turn it into a homeless shelter. I think this would make a great homeless shelter. Who is with me? Yeah. Welcome to the homeless shelter. Fuck yeah. <laughs> so just like expose the Federal Reserve, map out the computer systems, and force every level of the Minnesota state government to recognize it launders drug money, then you shut it down and replace it with something that does not arbitrage the availability of credit. It does not force you to have to borrow money at interest to finance the government. That's all you got to do, people. Let's do it! Yeah! Yeah! Thank you very much.